What's up everyone, MSD here back with another video on Marvel Contest of Champions. As you can see, Nimrod, rank 4, Nim God, Nimmy, whatever you want to call him, my 6th rank 4. I had no idea I was going to be able to bring a 6th champion to rank 4. After I brought Doom up, ranked him up and all that, I claimed uh, the materials I had from my inventory, from my overflow, and I saw that I had rank 3s with the, with the blue arrow. And I was thinking to myself, how? How is that possible? So, yeah, I didn't know this was going to happen. I guess the deals the unit offers with all the fragments were just enough to push me over to a, a six one. And I just selected Nimrod, so I thought, might as well be Nimrod, because I really like Nimrod. He's one of my favorite champions, and I've always wanted him. So, have the chance to take him to rank four, might as well say screw it, YOLO, and I did it. Now, this Labyrinth Showcase isn't the most impressive thing you'll ever see. I totally understand that going into it. Um, mostly because he is unawakened, so the ramp up is slower against mutant champions. So this is almost like if I were to use him against any other class aside from mutant, that's what using him unawakened is kind of like. Because when he's awakened against mutants, everything is doubled, so the ramp up is just that much faster. So, yeah. Definitely want to get this guy awakened, so he's even more of a titan. Um, not sure what else to say, aside from... This is not, like, the craziest gameplay, but it does showcase all of his utility. He doesn't... The only thing he truly gains from being awakened is when he's in eradicate mode. His specials aren't blockable, and like I said, the doubling up against mutants. But everything else is here in his kit that energized the unstoppable. Um... You know, the energy vulnerability, that power drain, the cowardice. Not super great against Old Man Logan. He doesn't have prowess to remove or anything like that. But this is just a, a nice vanilla showcase of his damage and sustainability. I didn't really lose that much health here. And just goes to show that Nimrod is a beast. I really can't wait for Eternity of Pain Anger that's coming this upcoming Wednesday. Um, what, July 5th it is? July 5th or July 6th, uh, I believe it's, yeah, July 6th, because Friday is the 8th, yeah, so July 6th is, uh, Eternity of Pain, Anger, I can't wait to see, um, that initial fight, and of course the fights to, uh, to follow it, hopefully Nim God can be used for some of them, or if I can, you know, force Nim God to get a soul on one, that would be pretty cool, but yeah, I'm just really happy that I finally have him, and, the hunt to get him awakened is totally on. So, thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you enjoy the rest of this. Take care.